that. Look at that. Page 16 and 17 double page spread. That is beautiful. Yo, here Gaston here and thank you for tuning in to watch my live reaction of One Piece Manga Chapter 986. I've managed to stay away from pretty much all spoilers for this chapter and I'm very, very hyped. It's been quite a long way off to so much information in the last chapter. The only things I know is that either this chapter or one of the upcoming chapters made Oda's new editor cry. I'm not sure if it is this chapter. I didn't want to read too much into it in case it came up with loads of spoilers as to why the editor did cry, but... I mean, if I was working for Oda, I would be crying all the time as well. I'd get my first manga page, and no matter what's on it, even if it's this cover page, sorry, I can see with Pound, I'd be crying because I'm like, I'm working for Oda, oh my god, it's the best. But it could be good crying, it could be bad crying, not sure yet, and I know that Momonosuke is a very prominent figure in this as well, because I've seen it in thumbnails and everything, so... Yeah, no memo, no skate and crying. A uh, quick bit of like uh, speculation. Let's just uh, think right now because I've had a little theory. Maybe Momo no skate under stress and all that, he's going to transform into like an even bigger dragon to get like out of the chains and stuff. Maybe can't control it. That little world prediction. Let's see if that is the case. That would be epic if it is. Okay. So I said that I saw Pound. I can see Pound here on the cover page. Sorry, the Capone cover page. Sorry, is still going. This feels like it's one of the longest cover page stories and one of the worst. We can see uh, Capone here. He's leaving. He's leaving Pound behind. Good. Good. Leave him there. We don't want Pound in the story. I don't want Pound in the story. He should have been dead. Leave him behind. Even though his ship has got I Heart Family written on one of the sails. Uh, they're leaving him behind. I doubt this is the end. I hope it is the end. But I imagine they're going to go back and pick him up in the end. The chapter 986 is called My Name. Okay, not much to speculate on on my name. I guess it could, I guess it could relate to me like Momonosuke. Maybe, okay, big predict, little prediction, big prediction. Uh, Momonosuke is going to be like, he's in his chains and he's going to be like, My name is Momonosuke, son of Odin. You know, yeah, I'm back. I am a member of the Kazuki. And then Yamato is going to hear that. That would be cool. All of um, Orochi's, like, doubters are going to hear that as well and be like, oh my god, Orochi was correct. Oh, and we might get revelations on Orochi. The fact that he was killed. So let's get into this. Let's go. First page. Onigashima, rear entrance. And we see, well, like, the Jaggedy Mountains. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, I just looked over. Okay. It looks like I've skipped a lot of information. Rear entrance. And now, best of luck to you, Sir Kinemon. Hey, Sir Denjiro. And to you as well. Hey, we got some of the minks. You see the giraffe one. There is Kinemon. There is Denjiro. Kyoshiro. And then, he, yeah, here's the, here's the thing that I just glanced at that looks weird. So we got Rizo there. Why has he got... Why is Rizo face palming like... Ah, oh, what... <laughs> Is he like, oh my kidding my man, pretending you're the boss still or something like, he, he kept doubting, you know, he kept uh, throwing shade at Kinemon when Kinemon got all of the big respect in the previous chapter. So what's going on with Raizo? Karamatsu, um, Izo, Kikinojo, Ashura Doji, Inarashi, with his sword leg, we can see that there with his like little wooden leg, and uh, Neko Mamushi, and there's Kandra, well not wooden leg, metal leg, there's Wait, and there's Kandro defeated. Kandro got off panelled. Ah, oh, what? Kandro got off panelled. That was so quick. Surely not. Surely not. Oh, what? That's disappointing. Straight away, I'm a little bit disappointed. I wanted to see that. I wanted to see a lot more of Kandro's powers. And what happened to Sasaki? Don't tell me Sasaki is all chained up still. I thought he was going to bust out of them chains, catch up to Denjiro. Hmm. Maybe, maybe that's why Raizo is face palming because he's like, ah, oh, people are going to be angry that Kanjiro got off panel. Anyway, let's carry on. Uh, oh, we've got a little flashback here of Odin. Ha ha ha. We have no money, Lord Odin. Uh, what will we do for dinner? All right, time to work. Go into town and beg. Okay, so just a little flashback as to when they were one big Happy family. Oh, yeah, there we go. There we see Kinemon looking down. At... Oh, Rizo is crying. Okay. So, yeah, we got uh, 
Kinemon looking down at their friend Kandro, their old friend. Yeah, ha ha! And uh, Kinemon doesn't look happy about that. Yeah, that's probably why Raizo is crying because they had to take out their friend. Would have been nice to have seen it though, wouldn't it? But uh, and then we got Akika Nojo, the victor, wearing wearing her mask. I know it's been hard for all of you. Oh, and Kinemon, you know. Kandro's on the floor there, defeated, but Kinemon just keeps walking. I know it's been hard for all. Hey! And they see Izzo, then Jiro. Izzo! Izzo! says Kinemon. And they go in for the handshake. So, this is where you've chosen to make your last stand. Last stand? Wait, why last? I've missed too many chances for a glorious, meaningful death. Kinemon, why are you talking like that? <laughs> why are you... What? Don't put yourself down. Don't die. Don't die. Very well. Let's hurry. Don't foreshadow your own death. Or El Izzo's death. What's that about? Is, it, is Izzo, like, sick or something? Uh, very well. Let's hurry. Choose Samurai... Of Orochi. Oh, okay, so we're going back inside. We see Kandro defeated and everybody else in that little group defeated. There, there's Kaido. Will you die here like your liege? Or will you conquer the world with us? You ain't conquering no world. Uh, oh, so we've got some... That guy's got... Or oh, Gail's got like a big, like, Kumurasaki-style hairstyle. I'm familiar with the great loyalty of Samurai. If you choose to fight us and die, I give you my praise. Oh, okay. That's quite nice of you, isn't it, Kaido? Fukurakuju. Former Onuobanshu captain. <laughs> Fukur yeah, former, because there we see Orochi's head. Not dead, though, is he? The 5,000 members of the Onuobanshu, the Ninja Force of Wano, are at your beck and call. Oh, you coward. You coward. And the Samurai of Wano, 5,000 strong. Offer you our allegiance. Former Mini Wari Gumi Captain Hoti. Mm. <laughs> so we see. Okay, okay, this is interesting. So they, they've both the leaders have both said yes. We're at your side, but we see the uh, we see the other people. We see the other like only a bunch. We see Hanzo there and all that. They're like, phew. So like they were like, uh oh, whose side do we pick? So maybe. Maybe there's still room for them to, uh, to flip side. Poor Shogun Orochi. Well, whatever, says uh, that kind of spotty looking person from the samurai. <laughs> hey, we didn't want to have to fight you guys anyway, says the random beast pirate people. Mm, I reckon they're still, I reckon they're just doing it out of cowardice, right? They have no warrior's pride, says Hyogoro. Boss Hyogoro, stop! Oh, we got Big Mum. Oh, we're going to get some Nami and Carrot stuff. Uh, ma, 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 ma. <laughs> so, we've cleared up the manpower question. Keep them nice and snug down there. Yes, mama, says all of her like brand new little Wano style homies. One's like a fire. Uh, let's go. We've got some like, I don't know what it is, a mattress? Uh, as long as they don't spot shinobu we still got a chance thinks nami so okay she can still save momo oh we see shinobu she's like bouncing around swoosh swoosh sorry sorry oh nami i'm going on ahead says shinobu lord odin saw the situation clearly he knew that vanquishing orochi would change nothing even 20 years ago the true enemy was kaido yeah, very true because Everybody who serves Orochi are cowards, so they're always going to follow the strongest person. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, kid. He's talking to, he's talking to Momonosuke, not Eustace, kid. Now Wano has neither a shogun to lead it, nor samurai to serve him. He's, he's totally going to be like, I'm Momonosuke. I'm going to be the future shogun. Believe it. <laughs> Kaido continues, the fools in the flower capital are carrying on with their festival, unaware that this is their final night of freedom. We see people partying away in the flower capital. I always had this nagging doubt in my mind. And there we see Momonosuke all beaten up. 
Kaido's going in, he's like putting his arm almost around around the uh, crucifix that uh, Momonosuke is attached to. How could a little coward like you possibly be the son of Kazuki Odin? This execution is meant to bring an end to the old Wano. But now that I think back upon that day 20 years ago in the burning castle, you did not answer my question. <laughs> so Kaido had like something, been carrying like a little burden all this time. What is your name? I'm going to fall, it's too high. So we've got a flashback to that moment. My name, my name, the chapter's... Momonosuke is going to answer Kaido's question. If you are not the son of Kazuki Odin and Toko, then I'll call off this execution and offer a full apology for the confusion. So I ask you one more time, boy, what is your name? Oh, okay, this is going to be a good big moment for uh, Momonosuke. Okay. Okay, so... Kaido really wants to know, doesn't he? He really wants to know if this is Odin's son, Odin's heir. Because I still think Kaido does have that respect for Odin. Okay. <laughs> You're so kind, Master Kaido, says Random Fodder. One little white lie and that kid gets to live. This is all now on Momo's pride. Okay, my name, he's thinking. You better come up with a funny name, kid. What do you mean that little boy is the real Kazuki Momonosuke? Says Yamato going down. Luffy, <laughs> Luffy and Yamato having a chat while cutting down just random fodder. Yep, and all the vassals are still alive. What? Now, let me take these off like I promised. Oh yeah, of course, because Yamato still had the handcuffs on. You just want them removed, right? You just want them removed, right? Well, uh, what else? What else does Yamato want with them, Luffy? Phew. So, oh, he's concentrating. And you can see him there. He's like bending. He's like bending them. And he rips them off. They're off. And Yamato looks shocked. Oh, okay. Now we're getting... Uh, well, what's, what are their names again? I forget their names. We're getting into some of the Toby Ropo stuff. Oh, uh, who's who? Who's who? With uh, like a little cat person. Still thinking Saber Tooth Tiger. The performance stage, you say? Uh, oh... He's talking, you see the little Denden Mushi, You're talking to Ulti, Yamato and Straw Hat Luffy are heading towards the stage. You'll pay for this, Yamato, so... Oh, hang on, we got, we got, um, the, 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 the Brachio tank now with legs. We got, so we got Usopp and Chopper. Usopp, we're going the wrong way. They're in, like, some place with, like, loads of barrels and everything. Hey, you heard that announcement. They're going to kill Momo, so we got inside... <laughs> Chopper's crying. Why are you crying always, Chopper? There's danger all around, Usopp. Are these giants? Are these gi what giants? Where are they? Trust in the toughness of General Frankie's exterior. So, yeah, we see like big barrels, big... Are they like... Oh, are they amongst the numbers? Okay. Hick! Intruders! There's some random fodder. We see Karamatsu. Karamatsu goes in... Got a report. Yeah, they get cut down before they can even do the report. Should have been drinking. Oh, this is cool. This is really cool. Look at this. We've got, we got Law. We've got Beppo in the background. In Beppo's, like, classic pose, we've got Kid there. And, uh, oh, Kid's, like, back to his normal clothes as well. We've got uh, Zorro there. He's looking <laughs> pretty fierce. Momonosuke up on the stage, waiting for, the, waiting for his answer. You are meant to one day... Oh, is this lady? Is this Toki? Carry this nation on your shoulders. Oh, we've got Luffy. One day I'm going to be the king of the pirates. We've got Odin there. Okay, so, you know, he's heard Luffy say his dream. Is Momo going to say it? Uh, and there's uh, the crowd again. I just realised that the person with, like, the big Kurosaki hairstyle is... It's, it's Lin Lin. It's Big Mum, isn't it? Momo is a name that seems second to none. Momo is a name that seems second to none. My name is... Oh, he's speaking. Okay, next page. This was page 10 and 11. Let's go next page. Here it is. Here it is. Page 12. Kazuki Momonosuke. The man who will be Shogun of Wano. Pure 
inspired by Luffy. He said it. He's got his determination. Now turn into a giant dragon. Come on. Come on. Wah, huh? We've got people in the crowd. We've got Kaido. He's looking a bit shocked. Everyone's laughing at him. Uh, everyone's laughing, but I doubt Luffy is laughing in the crowd. I bet he's very proud. Father, mother, I want to be a man worth, worthy of facing you in the afterlife. Hiori, I wish I could have seen you again. I don't want to die. I don't want to cry. It's, a sh it's shameful for a warrior to cry in front of others. He's thinking that, but he's crying. We see Kaido in the background picking up his weapon. There's a big explosion. Whoa! I can't believe that cow gorilla. What? I can't believe that cow gorilla... He really was going to kill me. I can't believe that cow gorilla. He really was going to kill me. What? We got Yamato with tears coming from Yamato's eye. I don't know if that's because of Momonosuke's speech. Uh, we got Luffy being flying back. They clearly got hit in an explosion. Well, oh, <laughs> Yamato's calling. Oh, I'm guessing that's the handcuffs that blew up. Yamato's calling Kaido Cow Gorilla. <laughs> Is it because he's got the horns? Okay, Cow Gorilla. I like that. <laughs> Kaido Cow Gorilla. Last name confirmed. Kaido Cow Gorilla. Uh, so <laughs> Yamato's now got the truth that Kaido was actually going, actually put real handcuffs on uh, on his son. Well, that set was it. I no longer think of him as a father. Wait, Yamato, says Luffy. What just happened? Did something explode? It's Yamato, so we got random people in the crowd. Well, we made it in time. But we're not the ones who start this battle. Oh! Because we see Kaido. Oh, did Luffy... Hang on. Sorry. Did, did Luffy sense... Because I've just seen... We had Kaido going for his weapon. But in the background we can see... We can see Raido, Nekomomushi, Inarashi. Did, did Luffy sense them? Did Luffy sense them? And Luffy's being smart here. He's being really smart. He's like... No, no, no. This isn't, this isn't my fight. This is their fight. I'm just here to help. You know. I'm here for Otama and my promise. But... Let, let them take the lead. He's showing real maturity. Okay, this is really, really cool. So, we got uh, we got King there. The Yakuzawa Samurai. We got Queen doing Queen's face. Uh, where'd they come from? We got Jack. The Mink Kings, they're alive. Yeah, Jack, you messed up, man. So, oh, Izzo, bang, shoots uh, King's sword straight out of his hand. Izzo, Raizo, Kawamatsu, Kikunojo. Two swords in an arashi. Meow. One gun. Neko Mamushi. Wait. Whoa. Hang on. Has Neko. Neko Mamushi. Neko Mamushi, you legend. Did you. I can't tell what he's. If that's like he's kicking it out. But he has knocked Kaido's weapon out of his hand. Neko Mamushi, my man. Yeah, boy. You're so much better than in arashi. Yonko level, Neko Mamushi confirmed. We got, there goes, Kinemon going in. Hmm? Is that you, Kyoshiro? S oh, is that Kaido saying that? Surrender your name. And be as a child. Put your life into this attack. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Page 16 and 17, double page spread. That is beautiful. Okay. That is really good. Mo okay. Momonosuke has uh, said his name. And everybody else, they are... Uh, they're taking away their names to put energy into their attacks. Because I can see a word up here. Really good, actually, because that episode... I just watched that episode in the anime where Momonosuke first started saying... Sunache. And, uh... 
you know, you, you take away your name, you put energy into it. But and and Okiku was like, you shouldn't say that because Momonosuke should be proud of his name. Really good. That's really good. Okay, your swords can do nothing to me, says Kaido. Never come back to Wano. So we got a vision of Odin. Oh, and then, and then uh, Kaido's like Odin, so he kind of sees Odin's will in these people. Oh no, this ain't time for drinks. Grab your weapons. Everybody else is drunk. The plan is working perfectly, and here they all go in. Beautiful, beautiful. Okiko Nojo, Inanarashi, Raizo, Ashura Doji, Neko Mamushi, Izo, Kawamatsu, all going in. Kinemon Denjiro, Kinemon Denjiro at the front, adding new scars onto Kaido's chest. Nekomushi's, uh, Kaido's grabbed Nekomamushi's head. Nekomushi's going in with, with his claws. Sunache! They've thrown their name away. They've put their heart into the battle. It's a raid! They're pushing Kaido off the stage. Next chapter hits August 10th. No, not another break! Oh, no, good, no break, no break. That's excellent. King is in the background being blasted back. Oh, being shot by Izzo. I can't see anybody else in that. That's the end of it. Oh, my God, that's so good. That's so good, that last page. Look at Mamushi's tower, it's massive, isn't it? That's so good. Yeah, yeah, really good, really good. Moment, like, I'd, I'd cry. I'd cry if I was editing this. Oh, beautiful. Just that page, beautiful. I'm glad, I'm so glad. Kinemon, you know what? I'm, I'm getting excited. I've got a review to do. I've got a review to do. I, I'm gonna try do my review, uh, maybe tomorrow. Can't do it Wednesday, cause I'm out for a curry. Um, lockdown, <laughs> assuming that we're not back in lockdown. And uh, so Thursday at the latest, but very excited to review this. Got lots to talk about. Got to talk about Sunachi, Momo revealing his name, and this page right here. Kinemon adding a scar. The legendary Kinemon adding a scar to Kaido. Fantastic. Fantastic. Hey, so thanks for watching. What did you think? Let me know about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed my video, maybe give it a like. And if you really liked it, why not subscribe? You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Twitch. Oh, and here's a related video you might enjoy and something more fresh. I've been Higassin, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!